Good morning, friends. Let's talk about babies today for health and what they can do. I'm gonna share my screen with you and we can look at the health lesson. Remember yesterday we talked about uh, the doctor and Tito and his little sister, Carmen, and how they were different and how they were the same. And we talked about Carmen and she was a little tiny baby, right? Right? And she was very small. And look what's what we're gonna talk about today. We're gonna to talk more about Carmen. Look at, here's Tito. And here's Tito's friend. Tito's friend says, can we play base? Can she play baseball? Tito says, no, not yet. New babies, we can call, we call new babies newborns sometimes. Sometimes you hear people call them infants. So we have three different names, babies, infants, newborns. Um, but when you were a newborn, you could only do a few little things. You could cry and that was the way you told your parents that you were hungry or you were tired or that you needed something, that you were sick. You could cough and you could sneeze, you could yawn, you could move your arms and legs and your head, all those types of things. Very few things you couldn't. Could not walk yet, could not talk yet. You had to grow up a little bit. Mm -hmm. But as you grew up, right? As you grew a little bit, your muscles became stronger and you interacted with moms and dads and brothers and sisters and aunts and uncles more. We learned more and the, your muscles in your neck grew stronger and you could lift your head and you could roll over and you could reach for a toy if you wanted it. And pretty soon you learned how to crawl. You push yourself real, real hard with your little legs and you would start to crawl to reach those toys that you really wanted. And by about the time you were a year old or so, um, you would learn to walk. Your muscles got so strong and you saw all the grown-ups around you walking and you would learn to walk. Mm -hmm. It took you a little while though. Yeah, you've got lots of growing. You do so much learning and growing from the time you're an infant to the time you're about a year old. It's so much. That's why we see babies sleeping so much. And we think in our heads that they sleep and eat and that's all that they do. But that's because they're growing and they're learning. Their brains are growing and learning so much. One of the first things that little babies learn to do is they learn how to smile. And that happens when they're about two months old. Right? And then they learn how to uh, drink out of a cup. And then they learn how to talk. Oh, they learn how to talk before they learn how to drink out of a cup. That's right. And then when they're a toddler, that's after you turn a year old, they learn how to go potty in the toilet so they don't have to use a diaper anymore. Yeah, that's pretty cool, huh? And that's why they sleep and eat all the time because they have all of this learning to do. Yeah, and they're just little. They're still little. They're still not as big as Tito, right? Right? We see Tito here and he's trying to get Carmen to say, to say I love Tito. She can't say it. She's just saying, ta, 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 right? Yeah. Yeah, and Tito can do a lot more things than Carmen can, right? He can run outside. He can play baseball. He can ride a bike. He can go to school. Can Carmen do any of those things? No, not yet. She's not big enough. Right now, all Carmen can do is 
smile and eat, and she can hold her head up, and she can go grab for her toys and kick her feet, wave her arms. Can't do the things that Tito can do. Uh, let's see. But babies do love it when people talk to them. That's right. That's right. We look at all these pictures and we th maybe you can look at some pictures with mom and dad or <clears throat> the adult that's with you at home and see when you were a baby. I've seen lots of pictures when you guys were babies and oh man, you were so cute. So, so cute. Yeah, can you imagine being a baby? And one time your moms and dads were babies. Oh my goodness. They were newborns at one time and they had to learn everything too. Crazy, just crazy. Do you believe all that? Yeah, babies love to listen to people reading books to them. I bet you still like to hear stories too. I know I do. I listen to adult books, you know, grown up books, the big thick chapter books. And they, on my iPad, and they talk to me, they read them to me. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, friends. Uh, this is babies. Remember, babies have three different things that you can hear them called babies, newborns, or infants, right? And they can't do many things. They sleep a lot. They cry to tell us something. They move their arms and legs and they eat a lot because they have a lot of learning to do. And when they grow bigger and stronger, every single day they start to learn and do more things, right? but they're not as big as Tito yet. Very good, friends.